Thank you for hanging out with me today. This is KJ48, and welcome back to Ranch Simulator, where I've been doing a lot of off-camera work. First and foremost, uh, remember there was a brick building here? Yeah, I was trying to clear out all the trash from the stone building that was here, and I accidentally deleted the entire thing. What are you going to do? Um, I had to put some uh, some walls on it, this um, makeshift crappy chicken area uh, <laughs> in order to make sure my chickens didn't get out. I also put a water and a feed holder inside the chicken coop, small ones. Um, I also bought this pot because when you, ground, when you grind up the uh, meat, you need a pot to carry it in. And I expanded this um, pig pen. Now, how do I know when they don't have enough room? Because, like, people say, if, uh, people are telling me in the comments, if they don't have enough room, then uh, the pigs will just start dying. So, I'm pretty sure I'm going to slaughter the male today. Um, out of all these little baby pigs, one of them has got to be a male. And if they're not, I'll just go buy another male. Um, so, it should be it should be okay. Should not be a big deal. I'll probably slaughter that male today. Um, I'm pretty sure he's at his fattest. And, um, yeah, so I did, um, make this thing bigger. I've got this little entrance way here because like you guys are saying, when you're trying to get pigs in and out of here, they don't, they don't really do what they're supposed to do. Um, so yeah, we'll try and get that pig out of there today. We'll try and slaughter him. I need to save up about 33 to $3,500 because I want to build a house today. Now I was told, don't screw around, make the biggest house you can. And the biggest house I can make, as far as I can tell, is the retro farmhouse. 64 planks will not be a problem. Con 365 concrete and 140 metal is where all the money's going to go. So it's it's just the way it is, okay? Um, I've got a lot of planks here. I have been cutting wood. Honestly, I'm not really that concerned with the wood. I'm just more all about, you know, getting the, the food situation set up. So I'm not sure if I'm supposed to slaughter a pig right now, but I think I'm going to and just kind of see where we go from there. Uh, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to take... These only hold 24 meat. I think I'm supposed to get, like, maybe more than that i'm not really sure so what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna drive this over here in case i get more meat and i'll put it on the back of this thing i have no idea how the ground meat thing is gonna work this is all new to me i'm not even sure if i should be slaughtering the pig right now but like i said i've got a ton of babies in here and the fact of the matter is one of these has got to be a, a, a male i don't know when you can tell um can i tell with this one would that have the little um the nips on the bottom if that was a female i don't know but it is what it is you you come with me. That's the male right now. You can tell by underneath. Okay. So what we're going to do is... Now pigs... Um, I thought pigs only had like one baby at a time. They have like litters. <laughs> which I was not aware of. So that's pretty fun. Alright. You come with me, buddy. Come on. Come over here. Alright. Come on over here. Oh, he's stuck, isn't he? Um, Close this. Alright. You come with me. Alright, come on out here. Come on, come on, come on, run, 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 run! Alright, I will deal with that later. Okay, so I don't know how to do this. I guess I'm just gonna blast him and start, you know, taking care of business. I just, like, slept through the night, so it was a save. So it shouldn't be too much of a big deal if something happens with him. Um, let's go ahead and reload. Alright, come on, come on. There you go. And then we're going to lead him back over to where we want him to die. <laughs> I wish you could tell him to stay. And we're going to put one in his dome. Beautiful. Didn't feel a thing. I am a merciful lord. Okay, so now what we're going to do is... We're going to go ahead and harvest him up. Hold E to skin. You know, I really don't want his meat going all over the place, so maybe I'll just put it in here for now. All right, and we will just pick up as much of this as we can. And it is not wild meat, so we should be able to, you know, grind it up. I have no idea if, like, grinding it's all you need to do. I don't. I just don't know. I need a house, though, because I want to start making, um... <clears throat> I want to start making, what do you call it? Uh, by the way, that's 24, 25, 26. Okay. I want to start making uh, cheese, and I need to be able to cook it. So that's why I'm going for a house. All right, so we're supposed to... How do we do this? Uh, put in. All right, and use. Oh, okay, cool. Now, is that all that can hold? You need to take product. Oh, okay. 
So what exactly is that? Uh, some kind of meat thing. Can I put it in there? Um, well, we have to make room for it. So let's empty this out. <laughs> I can just keep putting it in and putting it out. Okay. We've got to empty this out. All right. And I am almost done turning all this stuff into meatballs, I guess. Let's see. What... Yeah. Pork meatball. Raw. Okay. Now, again, I could probably cook it at a later date or maybe like do stuff with it. I don't know. There's not a lot of information on this game out there. Um, so <laughs> I will learn as I go. All right. So we got one more here. There we go. I have no idea how much money this is going to get me. I think someone said these sell for like 50 bucks a piece, but they might have just been like, you know, rounding up or something or whatever, you know. So who knows? All right. I don't know why I put that on the ground. I should have been putting it in there. All right. Left click E. 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 <laughs> left click E. All right. We are going to have to take a couple of these. Not in the... Not in the, um, the cooler. But that's okay. Once I get the house built, I'm probably going to, like, start making a lot more coolers. Um, people said you're going to need a lot of coolers. So... I tend to believe that. All right, so I'll take this, leave it right here, and let's go see what we can sell this stuff for. Now, we do have to wait until we get the price multiplier and the item that we actually want, which is the meatballs, uh, but, you know, we'll get there. We will get there. Hopefully, I'm doing everything right. There's always surprises in this game, you know, like, oh, you bought the grinder, but guess what? You can't do it with wild meat or, you know, whatever. There's a lot of surprises like that in this game. We'll have to see how... Oh, boy. Okay, hold on there, meatballs. Hold on there, meatballs. You're good. Hey, meatball! What do you call Oh, that's what, um... The Ultimate Male versus The Ultimate Meatball. Remember? What movie was that, guys? And who said it? Alright. Let's see what we got here. Um... Beef meatball? Do I have beef meatballs, or...? No, pork. Damn it! Damn it! That would have been awesome. Okay. Well, you guys know what we do here. Go ahead and lay down to get the save thing going. And then we just go to load menu, load game. Uh, people told me how to do it quicker. Like, you don't have to, like, run back and forth. You don't have to save every time. You just go to load game. You don't have to go to the, um, to the main menu. I probably didn't even have to get up off the mattress. But, you know, just, like, make sure the save goes through properly. And then what we do is we come over here and we see what's what. By the way, whenever I do this, this door's closed, but I can get around from the other side. But I can also see through the window. Um, what do I have? Beef meatball? No, pork meatball. Hold on. Don't go anywhere. You son of a... Come on. This guy's not getting away. Yeah, suck on it. <laughs> Alright, really quickly, let's see if we need to reload this. I'm going to save it anyway because I just killed a deer, but um, let's just take a look. Really oh, it's open now. Beef. Pork meatball, 1.7. You know, maybe. Pork meatball, 1.7. It says raw. I don't know if it's supposed to say raw up there. We'll just kind of have to see. But for now... Um, oh boy, I don't even know where to put that meat from the deer. Alright, whatever. I'm gonna go get the meat from the deer. I got the meat from the deer. I got a price multiplier of two on wild meat, so I sold it. And now I've got a price multiplier of two on pork meatballs. So, let's go on out there. Can we open this door? No, we can't. So, like I said, when that door is locked, you have to go through the outside. If you walk far enough away and then come back, this back door will, like, change to open. But, what else? Oh, there we go. Change to open. Alright, so, if anything's in, um, these coolers, you have to pick it up and place it back down for it to be seen and there we go pork meatball multiplier times two and we are going to make 1300 smackaroos we are up to 3158 guys i am within spitting distance of what i need um i did the calculations and i think i'm going to need about 3300 dollars to get all of the metal and concrete i'm going to need for the house so i'm probably going to go ahead and get like 3500 just to just to make sure i mean we can go buy what we need now and just kind of go from there. Yeah, let's do that. It's a little bit easier to do it that way. Um, I am going to need some food as well. So what we're going to do is we're going to come up to the general store. We're going to grab 
Oh, those bags of concrete are gonna... Oh, hold on, hold on. No, change of plans. I need to go home, drop off everything I can. <laughs> and then I need to buy some food. Bring the food back. Or I could just buy the concrete and, and metal. I kind of want to buy some food for the animals, though. So I don't want to accidentally run out of, like, money. And then have my animals going hungry. So I think what I'm going to do is... Oh, I see a deer. I think, I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to shoot this deer right in the stupid deer face. All right, come on, buddy. Oh, where are you going? Uh, damn it. Whenever you reload the game and come back, you have to, like, reload your gun, too. These guys are really, like, hard to hit. Well, not that hard. <laughs> I did pretty good there. They kind of herky-jerky motion, kind of moving around stuff. It's kind of a little hard to hit sometimes, but... All right, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to gut that deer... And then I'm going to uh, clear out everything. We're going to go up and see how much concrete we could get home. I didn't even realize that, like, I'm going to have to buy, like, I think eight bags of concrete or something like that. And that's going to be a chore to get home. So, should be a lot of fun. All right, it's a little bit dark here, but I'm, I'm still kind of curious on how much I'm going to be able to fit on this thing. Um, I think I already have everything set up in here that I need. Oh, it doesn't remember. I had it set up in the car, but it doesn't remember. All right, so we're going to need, um, what is it, like? 365 kilograms. Uh, yeah, 365. And they're 50 in a box. So we could, um... Let's just order four to... And that's sort of six. Let's order six. Um, two is 100. We need 300. So that's six easy. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six. And check out. All right, and we are, it is dark as hell now, so let's see. <laughs> There's one on top right there. I don't know if that's actually going to count. Oh, these aren't that bad. I, we could probably stack these, I'll bet. Yeah, I bet we can get a lot of these home. I'm about $400 away right now. Uh, well, actually, not really. I mean, technically, I only need $400 more uh, to get what I need for the house. But I am going to buy I am going to have to buy feed. So if I had to guess, I'd say I'm about two or $300 away from having a good amount of feed for my animals and being able to make the house. By the way, the concrete fit on here, no freaking problem. I have all the concrete I need. I even bought most of the metal. I just need 40 more metal, and that's where the uh, $400 is going to come from. So we should be able to hunt some deer to get that, and uh, we will be making our big house today. Just got to cut up some logs, but honestly, um, I'm pretty sure I have about as much wood as I'm going to need for the house already. So, once I get the house, I'm going to work on a barn, and then I'm going to work on getting cows um, to make uh, to make milk. Well, cows to make milk to make cheese. Um, what else do I need? I got the house. I get the, I get the house. I get the cows. What else do I need? I need the bucket for the milk. I need eggs. What else? What else do I need? Freaking game has got me so excited. I've had to reload the game like 5 million times just to get wild meat on the list i'm just gonna deal with the 1.5 modifier it's all i'm gonna need so not really all that big of a deal <clears throat> so now that we got that what we're gonna do is we're gonna go up to the hardware store and we are going to buy 40 more metal uh yep we're gonna buy 40 more metal and then we should be good to go let's get on up there and get some metal hell yeah it's so metal getting metal I wonder how long it's going to take to build the actual house. Probably a long time. But I'll probably do um, maybe some kind of build laps or something in there. Put some dope music. Some freaking funk. Uh, I love funk. Like, I just... Whatever music I listen to, whether it's metal, rap, rock, whatever. It's got to have funk. Just... That's just the way it's got to be for me. Alright, so let's come on in here. And we're going to need 40 more metal. All right, should I just buy a 50? Is it the same? No, it's the same. Because if you buy five of these, that's 500. It's exactly the same. You don't have to buy more than you need. All right, so one, two, three, four. I'm going to save money, even though it's only like 100 bucks or something, because for feed. For feed food. Food feed. All right, so these things are a little bit smaller. Can I put these on top? Uh, son of a biscuits. I can't put them on top. All right, so we've got to move this back. Move this back, and that should give enough room. Let's throw down the tailgate. Beautiful. Well, guys, I'm going from zero to 60. Uh, <laughs> it took a little while for me to build a house, but it's going to be the best house that I'm aware of, right? 
I'm going to look one more time. Just make sure it's the best house. Let's take a look. There's the houses. Farmhouse PH2, PH6, PH4. So it goes PH2, PH4, PH6, and then the awesome farmhouse. This is by far the most expensive one. So it's got to be the best one. I don't see any arrow that shows any others. So, yeah, I think we're good to go with that one. It's getting dark. Let's get home, sleep, take care of the animals, and then start building ourselves a house. It is a beautiful day to build a house. So I'm thinking the house is going to go right here. And I think all my animal stuff is just going to stay over here. That's going to be all my animal stuff. So I think we'll put the house... Um... I mean, I don't know. This just seems like a pretty good spot for it. So let's go ahead and do this and this. Oh, boy. All right. So we want it to be kind of lined up with what we've started here. So that all looks about flat like that. It doesn't have to be perfect, but I'm thinking right about there looks pretty good to me. Right? Yeah. And then we have all this space for farmland. That looks pretty good. All right, cool. I wish you could put roads in the game, by the way. Um, oh, paint? Okay. All right, so we're going to need the concrete, the metal, and the wood planks. Let's do it. Oh, boy. This is going to be a timely process. Oh, 50 already. Well, I'd like to just kind of do a time lapse of this entire building process, but it's actually taking a little bit longer than even I thought it would. And I'm definitely going to have to chop some more wood. The concrete, the metal, that stuff's all taken care of. It's just about the wood at this point. So, yeah. All right. I'm going to go I'm going to go cut some more wood. This is the best way to chop wood. Having two of these things out here. Oh man, can you sell old equipment? <clears throat> Cuz I was thinking about selling that old one back. And getting another of the fast ones. Although, it only needs to be so fast. If it's too fast, then it'll be done cutting before I can get the logs back. So, that's not really that helpful. Yeah, so this is definitely going to be at least 40. I mean, there's no there's no downside to doing more than 40. Except it takes a little bit more time. But I'm going to need this stuff, man. Like, I'm going to need wood like crazy. You can actually buy wood, too, which I, I probably will eventually start doing once my farm really gets going. Alright, so that's, um... Man, my, my math. I used to be... I used to be so good at my multiple t multiplication tables. Um... 24? 8 times 3, 16. 17, 18, 19, 20. Yeah, 24. Okay. For some reason, I was thinking 8 times 3 was 32. I guess that's 8 times 4. Yeah, we've got plenty. We have got more than enough for this project. Not for the game, but for this project. This is pretty... Uh, I, I love the... Man, this, this developer, I did not see him coming. You know what I mean? Like, when I first played this game, it was fun. But there was, like, real issues with stuff. And just little things like, you know, putting meat in the cooler and the way these um, planks kind of like stack on top of each other it's just it's just phenomenal like i mean let's call, call it the way i see it it's just unbelievable like what he's done with this game and how do i only need like 20 more wood in this thing 
That's another thing that's confusing me. Let's go take a look. So I only need, um... Yeah, 24 more. Alright, fair enough. Fair enough, my friend. We're gonna have a house! A house! What do I do once I have the house? Okay. Do I have to actually make the storage containers that hold the meat and everything? Because I did see them. Oh. I did see them in... Here, let me show you really quick. See, check this out. Down here, we've got um, pre our preserving bin for meat and preserving bin for cheese. So what, what does that mean? Um, use for meat products, use for cheese products. Is that, like, do you have to put it there to, like, have it dry or whatever or age or what? See, these are, these are things I don't know. There's so much I don't know about this game. It's a really good game. Like, you know, when I first played this game, I was like, ah, you know, it's a sim game. It's, it's all right. You know, nothing special. Um, but I did have a f I did have a fun time playing it, and now I'm just like, whoa, this is um, this is turning into something really really good, like really good. It was good before. Now I'm just really the more I play it, the more I like it. And I don't even need farming. I would like a better way to make money early game without having to. Sorry, sorry, we're about to finish the um the house. So this is a sit up in your chair situation. Anyway, I'd like a better way than to have to like you know farm animals. In the beginning of the game. You know. Just run around killing deer. But. Maybe there is a good way. Maybe I should have been doing something else with the chickens. I don't know. It just seems like running around and, and shooting deer. Seems to be the best way to do things. Okay. So what are we waiting? Oh. I was like what the hell. I, I thought that was all the pieces. And it was. Hell yeah guys. We got our own house. Look at this place. Now I could like cook stuff right. How do I cook stuff? I don't see an option. I guess I just have to put stuff on there. Um, oh, is this where I put all the meat? And the cheese and everything? So, you know what I'm wondering now? I'm wondering if I could have made a preserving bin for meat and cheese and not needed a house. The only thing is, I don't think there's any way to cook stuff without a house. I think that's what you needed a house for. To cook stuff. Yeah, this is a dope house. Hell yeah. What is this? Oh, look at this place. That's a nice TV. Turn it on. No, 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 YouTube copyright. Blah, 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 blah. You didn't hear nothing. You didn't hear nothing. Okay, and we could save the game and sleep. Oh, this is like a kid's bedroom. It looks like. Yeah, this is. Oh man, hell yeah. Oh, you are a good-looking dude. So I was chopping all those trees, and I didn't realize I had a bunch of wood over here already. But you know what? I'm okay with that. Because I'm going to need a lot more wood. I mean, there's just no two ways about it. I think the next thing... Now, do we want to make a pen for a cow? Can we keep it... Here, let me ask you this. Can we keep our cows in here? For the time being? Just kind of keep them in here? Because if I... I think someone said put your cows in that, like... That old house or whatever. So if we can keep our cows in there, that'll be cool. While I um, gather the resources to build them a, a proper, you know, barn and everything. Now, does the barn need metal and concrete? That's another thing I need to look at. Take a look really quick. First of all, let's get all these stacked up here. All right. And there we go. It's a pretty good amount of wood. All right. So let's take a look. Um, barn. Barn just takes planks. Oh, dude. We can make the barn pretty easily. 20, 40. I mean, jeez. We, we can make the barn right now. I won't do it today, but that might be next video. I didn't realize the barn was so cheap. So it looks like you have the barn front section, the barn middle section, the barn back section. Then you need doors. Um, yeah, doors are going to cost metal. All right, fair enough. Yeah, you know what? Maybe I'll just make the barn. Can I... I I'm not really sure what I'm going to do, honestly. Because um, I need to make some money. That's what I need to do. And I'm really just tired. I'm really sick and tired of shooting stupid freaking deer. I kind of want to just, um, you guys got water? Yeah, you do. I just kind of want to, like, wait for the cow, wait for the pigs to grow up and kill them. So, I'm not really sure I'm going to do it. I, I will probably not wait for the cows, although, I mean, cows, uh, the pigs, I probably will not wait for the pigs. But, I, I might not be able to, because they're, you know, they, I got to keep buying food for them and everything. But, I don't know. I mean... Oh, that's another female right there. And that's a male. Okay. So, I can kill the female, right? When, when she gets big and fat? I only need one female. I can kill the fat female. 
That's that's just that, that just sounds messed up. I I don't feel right saying fat female. I'm not saying that. I could kill the rotund female. <laughs> this one right here. I can kill this one. Uh, because the other one's a female as well. I think I'm going to leave them alone for now. And just kind of see where things go. Um, there's, there's other things I want to build that I'm not really sure how they work. Like, um, the silo. Or the granary. Fills all troughs in area. But what, how far is the area? Does it show? It does not show me the area. So I could probably put this, like, right here. Um, actually, I don't really worry about the chickens that probably gonna get moved so i could put this like right here and then build something else on the other side but does it show the area that's a thing how far is the area all right i'm not gonna make that um i don't have the metal or the money to buy the metal so I, it's it's kind of irrelevant all right cool well i think i am going to go now i'm going to look forward to your tips guys you guys always give me great tips uh the, this far i'm really glad i saved up for this farmhouse it is the best one and it's going to be dope. I think the next thing I want to do is possibly either one or two things. Either make the barn or get a cow. Now, I could walk a cow home so I don't need a better vehicle, right? Question mark, question mark, question mark. I'm pretty sure people told me that. I can actually walk the cow home. So if I can walk the cow home and I can keep it in this building, I could start, like, getting on the cheese the cheese wagon. Um, I kind of want to get on the cheese wagon. So, uh Sounds like a drug addict. Anyway, um, yeah, that's kind of what I'm thinking about. Anyway, if you have, if you ended up enjoying the video, please remember to uncage that like button. Also, if you're new here, please subscribe for more daily videos. Thank you very much for watching. I'll see you next time. And until then, take it easy.